Hi, I'm Ruth. And I'm Sean. And this is the YouTube channel where kids get their inventions made. Kids invent stuff. So welcome to our first kids invention build of the year. This month we're going to be building Andrew and James's Illuminator jacket. And Ellie's Lego jacket. So to build Andrew, James and Ellie's inventions, we've got two crazy jackets to modify. For the Illuminator jacket, we're going to build super bright, colour changing LED lights into the jacket, connected with special thread that conducts electricity and a battery to power them. And for Ellie's invention, we're going to upgrade our second jacket to have a special Lego surface so it can be covered in Lego models. To make Ruth's jacket light up, we've got 80 of these special LEDs that we can sew onto the jacket. We're going to sew them on using this special thread that conducts electricity. And we've got some colour changing LED strips that we're going to put around the edges of the jacket. And as an added extra, lots of people suggested that we should build some speakers into the jacket. So we've got these two car speakers that we're going to build into the collar of the jacket. And we've got an amplifier so we can make it really loud. So we've marked up Ruth's jacket with some pins so we know where our little LEDs are going to go and we're going to use a needle to sew the LEDs onto the jacket. We're going to join them all together and then connect them to these little boards that will allow us to change the colour of the lights and do some fun things with them. We've got 40 metres of this Lego tape all in different colours which we're going to cover Sean's jacket with. So to stick the Lego tape to the jacket we're going to use some epoxy resin glue. So I'm currently just cutting up different coloured strips and attaching them to the jacket with the epoxy resin. Now this does go off after some time so I have to be reasonably organised to get it all on the jacket. And then I'm using the pegs just to make sure that it sticks to the fabric. Each one of these little LEDs has four little pads that we have to sew on and each one we go around three times and there are 80. Um, so we've got a lot of sewing to do. and we've just spent the last four hours sewing on lots of lovely LEDs with conductive thread. However, we've realised the jacket is too fluffy. The fluff gets in the way of our conductive thread, which means the electricity can't flow between the LEDs. Now the thread is great for making your own light up wearable clothes, but we've got a ridiculous jacket and it's not working. So we're gonna go kind of back to the old fashioned way of wiring in and soldering our LEDs. And we've worked out that if we melt a hole in the jacket using the soldering iron, we're very high tech, uh, then we can poke the LED through. It looks quite good actually. Uh, and then we can solder it and wire it as we would do normally. So the lights that we're using for the jackets are colour changing LEDs and to programme them we're using these little circuit boards called flora boards. So we're just programming the boards and we thought it would be fun to add some microphones which allow not just the LEDs to light up and change colour but to react to sound. Thank you to everyone who sent in an invention idea for this challenge. And thank you to Andrew, James and Ellie for your invention ideas. We loved building your ideas and we're super excited to be testing your jackets next episode. So we'll see you next week. Bye! Bye. Thank you all for sponsoring this episode. Kids invent stuff.